top 20 regrets in life to avoid. When we are young, we live life vicariously, and sometimes we miss out on what's really important when we don't give much attention. This results in regrets. While it's impossible to avoid regrets completely, it wouldn't hurt to be aware of the regrets older people admit to having in order to learn from them without having to experience them firsthand. So in today's video, we are counting down the regrets in life to avoid, according to a survey by author Rank Sonnenberg. Welcome to Savvy, where we have lots of practical wisdom to share. Hey. Don't forget to hit that like button below, and while you're at it, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more advice here at Savvy. Number 20. I spent so much time believing I had no chance that I convinced myself not to try. Doubt is a life killer. You may be a living, breathing person, but you won't be actually living life unless you believe in yourself. Among everyone in the world, make sure to believe in yourself first because you are your biggest fan. When you trust yourself first, others will follow. Number 19. I put myself down so much that I became my own worst enemy. Like number 20, just as you are your biggest fan, you are also your biggest enemy because when there is no one else, you are left alone with your own thoughts. While it's good to correct yourself, try to encourage yourself as even more. Number 18. I spent so much time pretending to be someone else that I lost sight of who I am. This has been a problem even before the age of social media, when comparing yourself to others has become a common habit and common marketing bait. Please look at the mirror and be contented with your natural beauty and talents. Don't encourage your bad habits though. Just work with your natural gifts and improve on yourself without looking at others as the basis for what or who you should be. All of us are born with a unique and enough tools to live life without looking at others for reference. Number 17. I thought everyone knew better and learned the hard way that they don't. This regret is a case of not trusting yourself enough and trusting others more, even if they are just humans just like you are, capable of making your own way and making your own judgments. While your guts may not be completely right all the time, always listen to them first. Make your own opinions, and even if you end up wrong, at least you'll learn from it your own way with your own voice of reason. Don't rely on others too much. Number 16. I had such big dreams, but never took steps to pursue them. Dreams that live inside your head will only be just dreams and what-ifs when you don't take the first step to make them come true. Some of us back down when the first few steps towards our goals aren't as romantic as we envision them. Ultimately, when you are halfway towards your dream, you are 50% there already, and all you have to do is to take the very hard initial steps while making sure you remember how this world operates. Pursue your dreams now or get pursued by regrets later. Number 15. I worried so much about tomorrow that I failed to enjoy my todays. Live in the moment. It's true that we look forward to the destination so much that we forget to enjoy the ride. Don't make that mistake and just let life happen in the now because whatever does happen in the moment dictates how the future will be. Number 14. I wish I said I love you. Now that she's gone, I'll never have the chance. Not all of us find it easy to verbally express what we feel, even if we do mean it with all our hearts. But from time to time, make sure you say enough I love yous that when something happens, you've said it enough times to last the remaining years in great memories and not regrets. Number 13. I refuse to let go of disappointments and permit myself to move on. Disappointments are unavoidable parts of life itself. Without them, life won't be teachable and livable enough. But don't let these disappointments take hold of your life. Let them teach you, but don't let them grip you into unhappiness. You can move on anytime, 
And that's what the slow ticking of time is for. Number 12. I spent so much time doing have-tos that I rarely had time for my want-tos. Ah, the bittersweet choice of deciding between your needs and wants. While it's true that your needs will sustain your lifestyle, remember that your wants will sustain your life beyond just breathing. Your passions are your wants, and you need them just as much as medicine or breakfast or rent. It's all about balance. Number 11. I was so afraid of failing that I passed up some wonderful opportunities. Just like how marathoners get to the finish line, they encounter challenges or failures along the way. Not enough water, a sprain, or untimely weather. Life works the same for you. The opportunities do give you a chance at success. But you need to take on the inevitable failures as well. These failures will make sure you are strong and humble enough to learn and grow. Number 10. I took life so seriously that I rarely let my hair down. Don't be too rigid and serious all the time. Let your hair down literally or figuratively every so often. Not everything should be pristine and precise. Otherwise, life would be boring. Number 9. I lost touch with people I really cared about. No man is an island, as the song goes. Spend life more with actual people, the people you care about, and less time on extra work or alone time. You need that karaoke jam with friends more than you know it. Number 8. I wanted to be accepted so much that I compromised my principles. We fall victim to wanting someone else's approval, right? The worst part about it is that when what they want is clashing with what we are, we tend to compromise our principles and beliefs just for that approval. Let me reiterate that it's your life and you alone at the end of the day, so make yourself and your beliefs a priority. Number 7. I spent so much time comparing myself to what others had that I never fully appreciated my blessings. As the movie quote goes, just look at your neighbor's plate to see if they have enough, not when you have the same. Always count your blessings because they're different for everyone. Number 6. I never forgave him and the anger consumed me. While the person you placed anger upon has moved on for years now, you are stuck with the hatred that has now ruined your life. Forgive often and not for anyone else. Forgive often for the sake of yourself. Number 5. I placed so much value on possessions that I failed to see that memories matter most. This world is full of material temptations. Don't let hoarding or collecting rob you of the time you could have spent making memories with your loved ones or with yourself. Ditch that next trending phone and use what you have in taking pictures of a surprise visit to a family member. Number 4. I hung around the wrong people and I became more like them every day. Make sure you spend your precious time with the right people because who you surround yourself with dictates the value you expect to be treated. Choose your friends wisely. Number 3. I did some pretty ugly things to get ahead and my conscience never let me forget them. The means do not always justify the ends. To get somewhere, arm yourself with dignity and honesty. No compromises. Number two, when I was forced to choose between work and family, I chose work. While your career might provide food on the table, don't overdo it to the point of sacrificing your family and your time together. No work is worth losing those you worked hard for in the first place. Number 1. I spent so much time trying to please others that I neglected my own needs. Prioritize yourself in life and always believe in what you have to offer without the go signals of others. Life can be short, so remember to live each day to the fullest. Well, that is enough practical wisdom for today. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up below. We will be posting 4 to 5 videos per week. So click that subscribe button and that notification bell to be notified of our new videos weekly. Thanks everyone and see you in the next video. Ciao ciao!